Hey y'all, Rip One Outdoors. Hey, it's good to be back with you. Hey, before we get started, roll that intro. Uh, we have a review for you today. We are gonna be reviewing the Paseco phone mount. Cell phone mount for your e-bikes, your bikes, or your motorcycle. And con con I was contacted by the company and asked me if I would be interested in reviewing the phone mount. And I said, sure, but it looked similar to what I had and similar to what you see on the market today. Uh, but there was something unique about it. And I was kind of excited about it. And I said, yeah, yeah, I want to see this. So they sent it, and here we go. Looks like your typical cell phone mount. Spring loaded. It's got your little locking tab here in the back. Okay, and that locks it. Put your phone in it. My phone's an iPhone 10R. Release the tab, it locks down on it, and you can lock it back if you want. But here's what I like about it, y'all. Well, let me show you what I used, what I was using. I was using this. This is Brand X, I guess. Can y'all see that? It's got a whole inner tube like cut up to use as a filler. Like an inch and a half, two inch hole there. I didn't like it. It's clunky. It's hard to get on. And imagine trying to turn this amongst all them cables and everything over there on my e-bike. It's junk. But I, when I saw this, I saw something unique. And it's this little, I don't know what you call it. It's a button. But it's got a ratchet in it. This here is silicone and it's, it's gripped. It's got little grips on it. And you simply start your threads on there get right there you go and it tightens up and it tightens up run it on up look at that and it tightens down on any kind of on um, any size handlebar uh, what does the size say handlebars app applicable is 17.5 millimeter to 30 millimeter that covers a wide range uh, covers for phone sizes 4.7 to 6.8 inch all your modern phones will fit in here y'all I like it uh, and I gladly endorse it it's 1439 on their Amazon store y'all that's about seven that's about seven bucks less than this clunky junk seven bucks is that seven bucks you can use? Yeah. So anyway, it comes with a little, uh, nothing special, just a little instruction sheet on how to use it here. And it's pretty clearly marked English. We don't need instruction sheets for that, do we? But it's good to have them. We're going to mount it up on our bikes here. I got an Ocelot Pro that I haven't even ridden yet. And I got a Magic Cycle Cruiser over there. We're going to mount it on the handlebar extender for the Magic Cycle Cruiser and on the handlebar for the Ocelot Pro. Show you a couple of mounts there. Then we're going to take it down the road, one of the roughest roads and around, and, and show you all how it reacts on the uh, handlebar itself when, during the ride. Okay, y'all. We're going to start off with the Ocelot Pro. And you can see the Ocelot has got a pretty thin... Uh, handlebar up here and then it slopes down into a tapered handlebar so let's see what we can do here with it I'm going to take our U piece like this okay this is the other piece shiny on the back side here got a couple of holes up in there you'll see that's where these legs will go okay All right, down here where I can see it. Let me spin my little rubber silicone piece there. And 
And what I like about this thing, y'all, is look at this. I can get my whole hand on this thing. Okay? Look at that. Before we put the phone holder on it, look at that. I can get my whole hand on there and grip that thing and tighten it up. You can put some serious torque on that. Okay, let's put the phone holder on it. Put our little wing nut on. Put some, again, you can put some serious torque on there, on that wing nut. I got my phone here. This is a, that's an iPhone 10 R. You can pop that little tab if you want to. Flip the tab back, let it close on it. Lock the tab in so it's secure. There you go. Okay, y'all. We're here to my Magic Cycle Cruiser, and as you can see, my handlebar is pretty busy here. I got all kind of stuff in here. I don't even need to go no further. Check that out. Just tighten it up. Well, hey, y'all. Hey, we're out on the bike. Doing a test for the Paseco phone mount. And that test wouldn't be complete unless we put it to the actual test for what it's going to be used for on, on my part anyway. And that's mounted on my e-bike. We're going over a road here, y'all, that's not known for its smoothness. This, this is Alligator Bridge. And it's got some pretty, pretty bad little bumps on it. This is a Magicycle Ocelot Pro. I bought this for my daughter, and I got another one coming for my wife. And it's, it's a hoot, I can tell you. It's fun. This is rough bumps right here, y'all. If it don't come loose here, see there? It's not going to come loose. Boom, look at there. Okay, so that's going to conclude the test. As we said, we put the we put the link in the description, and y'all check it out. And uh, hey, that is going to be a affiliate, affiliate link. If y'all don't mind, hit that like and that subscribe. It will help my channel. If you want to see more reviews like this, I really enjoyed doing it, and I appreciate Posico for asking me to do it. They did not tell me what to say or did they pay me to do it but i appreciate them sending me this phone mount hey we'll catch y'all on down the road